guy that you see in all those commercials. What's that? Now do you recognize me? Maybe you still don't recognize me. Now do you recognize me? That's what I figured. Tonight, hold on, I'll be right back. me? I thought so. Tonight, I thought I was gonna, I'm going to take a break from doing all those wrestling movies that you see, and I figured, you know, why not do something completely different? Tonight, we're just going to relax, have a little bit of fun, and who knows, maybe you start having fun too before it's over. Remember to stay tuned later for a very special Voltron short. It may not be as short as you think. And now, how about a few of those fabulous commercials? No, I'm just kidding. We're not doing that tonight. Let's go in here. Let's fix ourselves a drink. I'll be right back after this. And I'm back. Uh, why don't we fix ourselves a drink? We start off with orange pineapple juice. Admiral Nelson's silver rum. Most people would probably use a mixing glass like this. Or... Or your everyday run of a mill barber shaking glass. Like this. However, tonight I will not be using any of these, as I will just be using two plastic cups. That's right, two plastic cups. Although, the thing about this, as you see the inside of it, it has a strainer, but the cap on top does not come off. No matter how bad I try, it just will not come off. So, the strainer on this, fucking useless. You can't use it. So tonight, I will just simply be saving dishes and using disposable cups. Normally, to get the precise amount of measurements of how much rum I'll need, you would see me use a shot glass, standard size, about like this. But tonight, we're just going to use our imagination. Now that you have your drink, drinks, and instruments of choice, it is now time to prepare the glass. I prefer cold frosted glasses, such as this one. Notice the amount of frost on this glass. Too much ice waters down a drink, while not enough ice adds nothing to it. So I use two ice cubes, sometimes three if the ice cubes are small enough. Now we will be mixing the drinks. First, we got to open them. Your Emery Lilson rum. And pour about... Oh, I'd say about that much. Maybe a little bit more. Okay, that's enough. Now, some orange pineapple drink. Fill the glass the rest of the way with your orange pineapple drink. Now, you will be mixing. This is very very tricky work and if not done right then the taste is well less than uh, uh, I'll think of it let's just say less than satisfactory sometimes you get a drink that's too strong or too weak here's what I do I pour it to one cup and then pour it to another cup <coughs> are 
evenly poured and evenly mixed. You do this not only to mix the drinks, but to mix up the pulp that's in the juice. Sometimes you can buy these juices from concentrate without pulp. Pineapple juice mostly is sold in cans if it's sold separately. Now that I have correctly mixed the drink, I will now pour the drink that is mixed into my chilled glass. You want to make sure you taste the drink before actually drinking it. Now, I believe I made it too strong. But nonetheless, um, we're going to now begin our night of fun by going into the next room and playing video games. So, for now, this is Mr. Commercial Man saying salute. We'll now take the drink and set it on the treadmill. I'm not worried about leaving rings because it's a treadmill and not a table. Get over here. Ugh. We have a wide selection of Nintendo games to choose from. I like track and field. It's awesome. Track and field, you want to use a controller with a rapid fire button or the Nintendo Advantage. Some games I'll use two players to easily beat the game. But that's not the case with track and field. Track and field works best with one player. Now, as you can see here, you've got lines going through the game. We got the one meter dash, the long jump, the one meter hurdles, the javelin throw. Let's try the javelin throw. You got lines going through there because it is being recorded. Oh crap. Uh, see, I'm not. I'm playing one-handed, so I'm not going to do as good as I would have done playing two-handed. I still qualify. I qualified, but I didn't beat the record. Let's play a little drinking game here, which every time I qualify, or I'm sorry, every time I beat the record, I'll take a drink. I'll be back in a moment with the results of this trial. Alright, 84.5. Woo! I hate that fucking line goes through there. I wish that wasn't there. 